and this is annoying. I don't, this is a bit <laughs> controversial. Oh dear. <laughs> but like, do you know Let's the way like here. all like celebrities and all are coming out and talking about mental health, which is good. But at the same time, it's like they're all saying, "Oh, I'm struggling with dep- depression. I'm struggling with anxiety." And like, then you have kids following them, like, and they're like, "Oh, well, this person I look up to is depressed. And maybe it's cool to be depressed." Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like? That's yeah. a that's a very um that's a i've always i've always thought that's a really weird place to be because i feel like that can really mess up someone who actually struggles with mental health issues yeah and they're seeing this and so many people have made the exact same statement that you've made and like where it's like glorified and like people are coming out because they think it's a cool thing now and like i look at that and you're like yeah fair enough but then i also think about the people who are actually struggling and they're like I'm not coming out because people are just going to assume that I'm just doing it because everyone's doing it at the minute. I think it's good that people are talking about it, but at the same time, it's like there's kids now on social media, and like social media is a lot bigger than what we, it was like when yeah. we were younger. Like. Mm-hmm. And like it's just like the the stuff where it's like you know you see them TikToks on you see them TikToks and it's like seven signs you're struggling from anxiety, mm-hmm. and it's like um, if you have any of these symptoms, you probably have anxiety. And it's like you struggle in large crowds, and now you're like, right. this is literally the WebMD of our generation. Yeah. Remember, like whenever we were in high school, it was like, was it WebMD? Like self-diagnosed, self-diagnosis, self-diagnosis yeah. where like you just typed in your symptoms of the internet and it told you what was wrong with you. Like. <laughs> and people were like, oh, five ways to live. Like the internet <laughs> yeah, says so. Like. Day tomorrow. I suppose this is oh, the new version. Uh, but it's like uh, things like oh, like if you've d- one of the things of depression is like you struggle to get out of bed in the morning. And like kids, fucking hell. And it's like yeah, kids yeah. who don't want to go to school in the morning could read that and be like, oh, lad, so depressed. Yeah. I'm not like I'm not making a joke. I'm just being genuinely serious. No, like, I, like, I, I agree. Like, I agree. I like it's the type of thing where if if we're setting up to like three o'clock in the morning playing Call of Duty. <laughs> and then you wake up at like seven to go to work it's like struggle to get out of bed it's like oh my god <laughs> do you know what i mean though it's no just... i completely agree but like do you not agree with me where like that is gonna i feel like that's gonna have people struggling when they actually like when they actually are affected by that stuff i think they just need to be more educated about like mental health and schools and stuff mm. rather than being educated by influencers mm. if you know what i mean yeah, like actually bring like um, you know the people who used to come in whenever you were younger and do the sex talk. Yeah, but like it's, show it you should be like I watched that there. Like there's good things as well. Like I watched that. Um, what do you call him? Oh, what's his name now? Ronan Kemp done a documentary on like mental health and stuff because like he he did, did, does that radio show like his best friend like committed yeah. suicide, mm. and it was really good. Like, but it's just I just think it's very like <laughs> on social Instagram and things. Like. What? I just, I mean, like, just for like influencers and talking about it, like, it's just like things I got. Like, it's like deluded or something. Sort of, or... Yeah, I don't know. Mm. I don't know. I'm not very good at explaining it. But this is just it. We're that's just what we're living in at the minute. Yeah, it's a bit confusing, but at the same time, we will get through it. Like everything. 